Rob, we're finally up and running. Uh, Pre-season is what it is, um, but you can only do so much running on beaches and training grounds. It's matches that count. Yeah, definitely, and uh, it was a good workout for us today. We were reasonably happy. We weren't too worried about the, the result. We said that before the game, um, but we got some young guys onto the pitch and we got some running into some of the older guys too. Uh, and overall, obviously always bits to work on, but we're, we're reasonably pleased with that. There's some stuff that we've worked on in pre-season uh, that came together really well. And obviously you'll look at stats next week and by and large, you'll say the boys have worked hard there. Oh gosh, yeah, they, they definitely worked hard. I mean, it's very, very. It's a bit of a different. We're trying to get pace in the game, and the ball kept going off the pitch quite, quite a lot, and trying to get the ball back in. So it's a little bit of a, um, bit of a round robin there, trying to get the, the pace high so you get a good blast on. But overall, st stats wise, yeah, we're in, we're in pretty good place. You say you talk about some of the younger players, Russ Tuimo in particular, really stood up today. Yeah, really, really good. I mean, he's worked very hard over the last. 15 months really, but particularly over the last season uh, to, to improve as a player uh, and to improve physically and improve his skills. Uh, he's defensively improved sort of out of sight uh, and he's really looking like a, an exciting guy to, to get on the pitch and you know that's what we're really looking for at the moment is, is the next sort of group of guys who are going to drive the team forward. You know you want some of those guys who've not achieved before to come you know force their way into the team and drive us on. You'll have video to work with and that's imperative going into a week like Leicester next week where you know they're going to come at you hard. Oh yeah, I mean uh, away at Tigers first game there, you know, they you can see from their pre-season games, uh, big and very physical, you know, there'll be a crowd there next uh, next week for the first time for them uh, in a proper match. So uh, I would imagine the atmosphere will be fantastic uh, and they'll be very revved up and uh, you know, today was a, a, a pretty good sort of workout for that, very similar in a, in a lot of respects. Law variations, some new ones in there. How, how are you adapting to them? How do you feel they went in today's game? Yeah, Did they, you make the, most of them? Yeah, they, they crop up occasionally sort of thing. They're probably not quite as big a deal. Um, actually, actually the, the ones that are probably going to make the most difference, uh, I think the scrums around the halfway line, so the 50-22 make it really interesting from, from an attacking point of view because uh, it does give you a bit of space depending on how the opposition set up. So we didn't see too many. We had a, we had finally had a goal line dropout uh, to deal with, um, which was good. So yeah, I mean we're getting through them. It hasn't changed too much, to be fair. There's just some emphasis on on, on other areas. Uh, but you know we're pretty happy with them, and it's always a bit of a, a challenge trying to keep up with the law changes. But uh, hopefully they'll leave these ones in place for a little while. And finally, having crowd back in is special, isn't it? It's just incredible. You, you just. You just don't realise how much you miss it until you get a few folk back. And then a, a great crowd like today, a decent turnout like today, just makes so much difference. Um, obviously, the atmosphere, I would have said, would be pretty different when we come back in two weeks uh, into a proper premiership game. You know, the stand will be a little bit more done, uh, which is great. And it's exciting when you look around and you think what that's going to be like when it's full of people. Um, you know, we've got to make sure we give them something to cheer.